compassionate people. Welcome to Vegan News. On Thursday, I was in Tar Heel, North Carolina, filming the protesters, live streaming, as some of you may have seen, and an unfortunate incident occurred, which we're gonna jump in into this video. The next video that comes out will be about the protest itself, showing all the footage and going through all that. Anthony C. Colini, pictured here, was thrown to the ground by police with zero provocation, as you can see here in the clip. These guys are violating our rights to get on public property and they're making up excuses and lies saying that it's not, but we've checked and it is. And as you can see in that clip, the camera pans away just as the officer is grabbing hold of him, but she pans back as he, they're taking him down to the ground. The officer had actually been pushing him uh, throughout the day as other officers did to many of us there. and multiple violations of civil rights occurred, which are all on video and can be found both linked on Vegan News, but I will be doing a video on that as well. Once he was on the ground, Officer Freeman, pictured here, began beating him in the head, causing a concussion and multiple injuries throughout his head and face, as you can see in this picture here. One of the reasons the North Carolina Highway Patrol gave for their actions being okay, which they've already investigated themselves, guys, don't worry, and they found themselves completely not guilty. They tried to say that he grabbed for his gun, which in this footage, it slowed down from some of the previous footage I showed, and is in on a close-up. Credit to Ryan Phillips for creating this. <laughs> And as you can see in that clip, his hand is fully clenched into a fist and he is not resisting whatsoever or reaching for the handgun as they said. His other arm, if you follow the video from the other point all the way down through the different angles, which we'll be showing here in one second, you can see that that arm is already restrained by police. That is the first arm they took him down with. So there's nothing he could be doing with that arm at all. Two officers have a hold of his left arm. His right arm, they have a hold of in the video where you can see in the close up. And again, his fist is clenched and he was not reaching for a handgun. Unlike the few media reports that there were in the local area in Bladen County, which is where this has occurred. Back up, man. Back up. Don't, don't, don't fucking touch us. Back up. Back don't up. fucking touch us. Keep your hands don't, down. Back don't up. Don't fucking touch us. Back up. Don't touch us. Back up. Don't touch us. Don't touch us. Back up. We're not doing anything wrong. Stop. 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 Anthony was featured on Jane Unchained and in that live interview, which you can also find linked on Vegan News, I shared it. He discusses how he will be pressing charges and I'm sure he'll be going after a civil suit as well. There were multiple things throughout the day. I myself was arrested, but then released after about 45 minutes, as you can see here. And the cops were hyper aggressive, more than I've ever seen in any video. And in fact, people from other areas that have protested could not believe the amount of aggression coming from police. There was about 200, 250 protesters there, and it was an unbelievable event. I'll be talking more about Smithfield and going over the facility in a video. And I also want to talk about the smell there of death and feces in the air. It was actually feces coming off the trucks all over the place in dust. You were breathing it in and tasting it. But I hope these extra angles and everything all strung together is enough proof for people to see that Anthony did nothing wrong. I was there, many activists were there, many cameras were there. We caught all of it on tape. You can take what you want from the video, 
but the fact is he did nothing wrong and if you look at it any other way you're the one that's wrong thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you in the next video love you bye